Is Bitcoin going to break out higher and take Litecoin, Ethereum and Ripple with it or are they all going to break down? Welcome back guys, it's CryptoRocko here and in today's video I'll be talking about the technical analysis and key resistance and support levels for the major cryptocurrencies. I'll also talk about one of the special coins that I'm looking out for. So guys without further ado let's get into the technical analysis and let's start with the King BTC because what Bitcoin does everyone follows. So guys we had like not a fake breakout but I was expecting it to go higher I didn't enter this trade but you could have probably earned some money but it, it double topped and it moved back down so it wasn't the best of trades now it hasn't broken lower so you can't call it bearish so bulls are still it hasn't broken lower um, made lower lows so we're still in a very very tight consolidation guys what we need to see is a breakout and a uh, lot of the indicators if you look at Bollinger, Bollinger Bands and how the price action is behaving it is pointing to a breakout probably in the next couple of days I would say but which way will it break out we're not sure one of the things that I'd like to point out is bearish divergence again people have different definitions for bearish divergences but the way I'm looking at it is this the price is moving sideways or potentially try to make a higher high but it, it hasn't been able to and the RSI is dropping so I'm not taking a trade just on that basis. I'm trying to see what the price action does. I'm hoping to see price break out. We still have moving averages support. We, uh, we've got strong support around there. So those levels that I pointed out in my previous video still stays and we have got resistance up there. So that is what I'm looking out for uh, Bitcoin guys. Similar to the, some of the other coins, Ethereum is potentially forming a bear flag and it could be losing its moving averages support, which is not looking particularly great for ethereum so that is what i'm looking out for ethereum it could i mean just touched above it if it forms a high low it, it could potentially break down so make sure you keep an out, out, eye out for ethereum because ethereum has run up a lot higher than uh, bitcoin and some of the other currencies some uh, other coins i've been trading a lot of currencies i'm looking at um aussie aussie yen so I said currencies instead of coins so that's what I'm looking at for Ethereum guys I wouldn't enter into a trade now but if it breaks down you could look to short it um, and you could get a decent risk to reward um, that's what I'm looking at for Ethereum guys Litecoin again is similar to Bitcoin Litecoin there's definitely a uh, bearish divergence on the RSI you can see a lower low um, let me make that easier for you guys So you can see guys the RSI is losing steam, definite bearish divergence and price is making higher highs. So that is there's definitely some def, uh, bearish divergence there. I wouldn't enter into a trade just yet. Uh, you could wait for, to lose the moving average, see the price action break down. Uh, breaking these levels you could, uh, Blackcon could be heading lower. So that's what I'm looking at. So all of the co major coins are at key resistances. So uh, keep an eye out for them. XRP guys, it hasn't broken out. It's still consolidating. It hasn't broken down either. So we don't know. We'll have to just wait and see what happens. It's just sideways. It's not the indicator is not telling me much. So XRP, I'm just sitting out on my hand and see what it gives me so that is, that is what I'm looking at for XRP I will make a detailed video of some of the other coins that I've been looking out for if you follow me on Twitter uh, some of the coins I've been talking about are XLM ICX Tron and hot so keep an eye out for them guys there's some really you could make some really good gains when major current major coins are moving sideways smaller coins can gain ground so Tron is one coin that has moved massively up if you traded when I posted about it you'd be sitting on some really really nice profit again do not just tra take my trade signals make sure you do your own analysis uh, I've been talking about Tron for a while so keep an eye out for that guys but Tron is facing key resistance now so uh, the risk to reward for going long here is not as good so keep an eye out for that guys and finally um, one more coin I would like to talk about is XLM so that is the post that I made last night uh, Bitfinex chart is not very good let me have a look at the Binance chart so Stellar Lumens guys um, it, I mean I did post um, let's have a look at my post so it was a longer term thing that I noticed on uh, XLM. You see it's kind of rangy. It, it, it really 
maintained and respected this uh, resistance levels and support zone so that's what i was looking at but i did post ex uh, two hours after posting this that you know it looks toppy there's definite uh, rsi divergence and it could be breaking down and ex that's exactly what happened it broke down and there was a potential good entry around that level to go long so Again, don't just take the trade because I've posted about it. Try to get your good entry. So if you had entered there, I would still be in this trade. I'm still in this trade from around around here. Um, if you are, if you are not in this trade, you could look to enter this trade around that level uh, at the break of this. Uh, you'll get a really decent um, risk to reward if you enter it there. Again, this channel, guys, I don't try to just talk about my analysis. I, I, I try to teach you and, and give you exact tips of how I enter the market and how I look at the market. So hopefully you can learn from learn from it. So those are my analysis of the cryptocurrencies guys if you if there is a specific coin you want me to look at just comment below guys i'm happy to do analysis for you on any coins or if, if there's a coin that you want me to do uh, just tweet to me on my twitter and i'll try and help you out or message me if you have any questions guys i'm always looking at charts i love technical analysis i love trading so if you have any questions guys just message me and i'll try my best to help you out so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you've enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it smash that like button guys subscribe to my channel and i'll come back with another great video for you so thank you very much happy trading and i'll see you guys soon